Hey guys and gals, Homestead Prepper, and uh, today I want to show y'all how to raise a roof, how to install gambrel style barn trusses on your barn and uh, by yourself. And I've already gotten a couple up there, and I just want to say that this video is for information purposes only. Always uh, hire a licensed crane operator and always use uh, uh, licensed professionals. All right, well, with that being said, um, what I did is I built a framework up there, and that way the, uh, the trusses have something to rest on, and that way I don't have to hold them up or try to brace them off. In effect, I've already got a bracing up there. And if you look, I've got the uh, sides of it braced in the front, and if you can see on the other side, it's braced, and I have X bracing in between. And it's all made out of um, two by sixes and two by fours, and on the top, I have a 2x6 beam and there's a 2x6 underneath it and that's what's holding everything up and I'll try and show you a little more detail. All right, let's go up here and uh, you can see how I have it uh, like I was talking about the bracing. I just have some 2x6s screwed into the floor over here and over there and you see I have my rafters they're resting on it and this one is tied off and I'm getting ready for the next one those are my uh, homemade uh, trusses they're screwed glued and nailed and uh, all I did I just drilled a hole through right here in this gusset plate and I tied a piece of uh, old climbing or repelling rope that I had and I did a bowline I'll give you a reference for that and um, I got my pulley here and you don't want to cross the ropes twist them up and I've got a pulley there up at the top and the way I have it rigged this is going to give me a three to one pulling ratio so if these uh, trusses weigh I don't know what they weigh but they seem pretty heavy uh, let's just say they weigh 200 pounds uh, then I'm going to be lifting I'll only have to pull less than 70 pounds to pull them up there so let me uh, give you all a little more detail okay here's a better look at my bracing and I have the ropes tied off uh, to that 2x6 and all I did was drill some 3 quarter inch holes in there and run the, root, the ropes through them and I have it braced that way so it can't go forward or backwards same on that side and then I have the X bracing and the truss is just set up here on that and uh, this one I have it tied off with a rope so it can't fall off the end um, when I undo that, well before I undo that I'll put a board right right there. You can see the screw holes. Alright, let's see if we can pull one up.
turn it off. Yeah. Thank you. 